In Business Central, filters can be used to restrict the data you are viewing in any of your list windows. Once you've got certain restricted lists, you can then save these views for easy reference at a later stage. Let's have a look at how this works. I'm going to use my general ledger entries as the basis for this video. So let's look for the general ledger entries. And you can see down the side here, I've got a number of views. If we click on one of these views, it gives me a different filtered view. So you can see my projects view is looking at a specific GL account and it's using a project code, which is one of my dimensions. What I'm going to do for this example is I'm going to have a look for any P&L accounts that do not have a um, department dimension assigned to them. I'm going to filter list by and I'm going to search for department. And here's my department code. And I want to see any that are equal to blank. That sorts of list there. Now I'm also only interested in GL accounts that are P&L accounts. I'm not interested in balance sheet accounts because I don't track the department dimension against that. So I'm going to add another filter for my GL account. And in this case, I'm going to put a range of um, 4,000 with two dots to 9999. And that covers my income statement portion of my chart of accounts. From here, if I wanted to make some adjustments to the dimensions, I could use the dimension correction tool. And if you want to see how that is used, then check out the video that's linked at the end of this one. Now to save the list, all I then do is come up to my save as and it pops it up here with a copy of the list I was on and I can say blank department. And that's now available for me to use at a later stage. Now you saw me add the filters by selecting from the drop down list. You can also use your column headers. So I could also add to these filters by finding a line that had something I wanted. So maybe this line here and in my top drop down I've got the option to filter to that specific value and that will add it to my filter pane on the left. Using filters and saving views applies to all list screens within Business Central. If you like what you see please like and subscribe and look out for future videos.